Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Carly Jade. If you are new here and if you are stopping by, hit that subscribe button. Hit that post bell so you can get anytime I upload a notification on your phone. Today I'm going to be doing a first impressions on the X Mondo. Brad Mondo shampoo, conditioner, and also got a styling product. So we're going to be doing a kind of like a complete review on the X Mondo. So we are going to shampoo this hair because <laughs> it's been a hot minute. If you would like to see my first impressions on the Brad Mondo X Mondo shampoo and conditioner or hair products, then let's get on with the video. So I'm going to open this bad boy up. Ooh. So you have first the X Mondo shenanigan right here. And then it has a card with Brad on the front. Signed by Brad Mondo himself. Came in this kind of packaging. Some of the people that I have watched other reviews and other first impressions. They had confetti. I was hoping I would get confetti. Anyway, so this is the color shampoo or the color extending shampoo and conditioner that I got because I do color my hair. I'm already starting to go gray, fortunately. Had my hair colored for a while. And with some hair products i have noticed that my color fading very quickly so one came with like the this and this one didn't so i'll be taking that off and i also got the styling serum little product detail on the shampoo is lock it up it says lock it up and make it last polychrome color extending shampoo is designed to prolong the life of your color by sealing it in prevent color fading with added uv protection vibrant hair for longer because why sell for anything less how to use it apply shampoo to wet hair and massage it in to a lather rinsing thoroughly and follow with the conditioner so it's ideal for a color treated hair straight wavy or curly hair so any hair top that is color processed is good to go with these two bad boys and apparently this is a vegan cruelty free gluten free sulfur sulfate free and paraben free so that's really really good and what I have noticed is it does say sulfate free, but it also has methicone in it. And dimethicone is a silicone to pretty much make your hair very shiny, but can also create buildup. We shall see, Brad Mondo. Okay, so these do have a fragrance to them, and the fragrance is supposed to be fresh and clean using a blend of jasmine cherry blossom bergamot white butterfly jasmine and sandalwood so let's see what these bad babies smell like Ooh. they do smell very clean like very very clean i'm going to go shampoo my hair with this so let's go wash our hair okay so i'm back with some wet hair and smells really good it lathered up really well i felt like the conditioner i felt like i had to put just a smidget more than probably what i was doing because i didn't put a whole lot and i think my hair just needed a little oomph. but it is a very nice shampoo it's a little runny but it's still pretty thick where you know that your hair is going to be clean Plus, with the conditioner, it's pretty much the same way. Um, I'll show you it here also. I mean, sometimes you get like a super runny consistency and it's not going to really cleanse your hair like you would need it to. 
this one's actually pretty nice it's not too thick where you're gonna have to use a ton but it's the right amount where you're not using as much shampoo if that makes sense yeah i forgot to mention this earlier so this does run at 25 dollars for the shampoo and the conditioner is also 25 dollars so i would say it's a little bit more on the kind of luxury and shampoo if you ask me because you're really not supposed to use that much shampoo also you should save shampoo because of not having to wash your hair every day now a lot of people that still wash their hair every day i am now going to try the glitter glitter glitterati styling serum the product details about this is a styling serum delivers hold shine and lightweight hydration make sure look last and top off with the finest sparkle yep you got sparkle so how do you use it is you put a generous amount of damp hair starting at the ends and work your way up blow dry and style or scrunch this runs for about 20 this right here is 29 dollars better last me a long time because i ain't about that whole generous amount I'm going to open this bad boy it does have a pump and we're going to oh. i'm gonna do about that much rub it into my hands put it on the ends of my hair I do like the smell of this. It does make my hair smell really, really good. My hands are super sparkly now. Like, you see that? Can you see how sparkly my hands are with my hair? Look at that. Maybe it'll hydrate my hands. The top is a really nice top. So let's blow dry this her so I'm back I styled my hair after blow drying it and I wanted to give the style and serum you know a chance to show itself off because you know if you don't do the full effect you're never gonna know about the product this is my hair after using the shampoo conditioner and styling serum now at first i was a little skeptical about you know how's my hair gonna feel is it gonna feel dry is it gonna feel like you know i got a salon feel at home and i honestly think i did because the reason why i say this is sometimes when you shampoo your hair it still looks pretty dull at the end when you shampoo condition style and it can still look pretty dull it can still feel like it doesn't have life in it and that is the opposite for me i feel like i've been to the salon i feel like my hair got a salon feel if that makes any sense i really like the styling serum just because it doesn't make your hair look frizzy it makes you look like you just walked out of the salon i mean what else could you ask for this is just a first impressions video i want to give it some time i want to do a full honest review in about you know a few weeks just to give you a full aspect of the product and another key thing about shampoo and conditioners even though i don't like using a medicated shampoo because i know that it's going to fade out my color because that's what medicated shampoo does i just want to see if it's going to irritate my scalp because of my psoriasis so that's also another thing that i want to see if it will actually do but i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell so you can get my videos popped up on your phone every single time I upload. How awesome is that? But I hope you enjoyed this video. I will be doing some more products review coming very, very soon. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.